Welcome to the channel. Thanks for joining me today. Uh, my name is Robin and this is my channel Aries Fire Tarot. So I am doing a week ahead reading for you guys and this is going to be for the week of, I was going to say Friday, but I do mean Monday, February 17th. So for some people this could be a holiday, like for Canada we're having a, a vacation day and I, I hope you guys are enjoying your day and you will enjoy your week wherever you are in the world. So I'm going to be using the Good Tarot to do this reading and it's just going to be a short three card reading guys and looking at the energy and what's going on. Um, so the first card is going to look at what you need to think about but I'm going to shuffle a couple more times here because I just grabbed the deck and I just want to make sure it's nice and clear for this reading. And I do look forward to your comments, guys, and let me know what kind of plans you have for the week ahead and what's going on in your life, or just say hello. Um, so let's see what you need to think about, guys. Okay, this card came out here. So we've got the world card. So I think this is a really important card to keep in mind um, when you're thinking. Um, just always keep in mind that you're capable of anything in any dimension. Um, I don't know if I'm like your typical reader where I look at at your energy and what you can make happen for yourself as a result of your energy and the way you think about things. I'm not a fortune teller. Um, and I do believe that everything that's happening around you is a result of the way you think. So what you need to think about is your accomplishments. You know, everything is an accomplishment. Everything was a lesson. Everything, like if you start to think in terms of failure, then that's probably going to have a cascading effect out to the rest of your life. So really just keep that in mind. Um, what you need to think about is how successful you are um, here on earth and in your other dimensions. I mean, everybody has an energy body and your higher self and then your guides are around you. So if you're having trouble staying focused on being successful, having a sense of accomplishment, really start bringing in your angels, your guides. Um, I actually listen to my own affirmations every morning while I get ready. Um, you know, I, I write affirmations out, I listen to them, I did a video of affirmations and they speak to me while I'm getting ready. So think about how amazing you are. Always keep that in mind, you guys. So what you need to do for the week coming up ahead, we've got the Queen of Water. So the Queen of Water, she's like really filtering out things here with her eyes closed. Like people close their eyes when they're ready to do something, um, you know, on an internal level. If you're going to sleep, like people close their eyes when they kiss something, kiss something. <laughs> Um, kiss someone do you know what I mean um, you really close your eyes when you're going within or you're doing something that is um, incredibly deep and meaningful so what you need to do is like really look within like this is a really personal reading for you guys and again if you're coming to my channel to look for how to win the lottery or stuff like that I'm not that type of reader um, I'm, I'm looking at what you can do for yourself to bring yourself to the highest level of energy um, and this is like really going within and the queen of water she's a very sensitive person and she does need to block out outside influences sometimes so you could just close your eyes to things that are really bothering you in the moment um, and and take care of what matters to you on the inside and you just everything is surrounded by blue and calming um, the water again water is such an amazing uh, calming effect guys let's see the challenge that you might have here so you have the page of air so you do probably have some troublesome messages coming in because the page is a messenger right so and the air it really talks about your thoughts and you know things coming in from other people and there could be something that's going to uh, I got the word and I sometimes the messages I get I really don't want to say out loud you know it could destroy you. you like you you may not get the job that you want you know you may ask somebody out and they could turn you down you know you could not get the car loan that you want something is may not work out for you um, in your favor or so it seems but just remember you guys, things that don't happen for you are not meant for you and they're they're meant for somebody else. So you're going to have a bit of a challenge dealing with that sort of what you perceive as a rejection right now, but just go within and calm yourself and do whatever you need to do. Like again, I always talk about bubble baths. I say it a lot because they work, you know? 
Um, go within yourself, silence your mind, silence the rest of the world. You know, the rest of the world doesn't have to have an opinion or influence um, over what it is that you do. So really keep that in mind here, guys, that, you know, something could come in and sort of shake you up a little bit, but outside circumstances don't have to dictate how you feel on the inside. So be prepared and have this sort of queen of water energy to you where um, if you look at the queen of cups or the queen of water through tarot deck, she's always very composed. And even though the seas could be quite stormy on the inside, so keep that in mind. Um, there's something called poise under pressure. Just, you know, the life, your life is a stage. So really keep yourself composed to the exterior world. world. Close your eyes to it and deal with your own personal storm. Um, everybody doesn't know, have to know about what is raging inside of you. You know, you have if you have trusted friends, you're really blessed and lucky and go and speak to them about it. But for the most part, really feel like whatever is happening is an accomplishment, even if in the moment it does not feel like one. So you have a really interesting week here, guys. A really good opportunity to maintain your cool, calm, and collected self. So I do hope you have a great week ahead and take care of yourselves. Bye for now. Bye.